your April. So today I'm going to do a what's in my bag video. I don't really think y'all want to know what's in my purse. Like I have like a lot of purses, like a lot of purses and I don't really throw much out. Like I will leave it in one purse and if I want to use the next person, I will like dump the whole thing in there. So it's like a mixture of everything. And if I don't do that, then you will go to another person and be like, damn girl, you got this in this purse and this in that purse. Do you want to throw out these old napkins? But um, no. Because um, you never know when you gotta wipe somebody's nose, and even if I already done blotted my lipstick. It's still good, and I can reuse it, so no, I don't want you throwing it out. No, leave my tampons in there, and yes, I still want that piece of gum that's in there. Like, don't touch my stuff. Seriously, don't touch my stuff. So, for a woman, you probably would think, like, oh, and I like to do makeup, like, my, I like to do my own makeup. Y'all probably would think that I have, like, makeup in my bag, but I really don't carry makeup in my purse. I just think, like, you know what, I am not about to make my face up while I'm outside. If my makeup comes off while I'm outside, then I guess it just came off while I'm outside. You know what I'm saying? I'm not about to sit here with no powder thing and poof, poof, all that. Like, the only thing that I will carry around with me is, like, a lipstick and like some chapstick that's it i'm not in a mirror but yes yeah, so anyway i figured i would do this back this video because y'all be so nosy y'all just want to be all up in a girl's bag and stuff and i will tell y'all this my bag do get a little bit heavy that's why i prefer bigger bags so first of all let's just start off with the bag that i have here which is a teddy blake bag and it is 12 inches and i think it's um if i'm pronouncing it right because i know how to chop up and mess up a name it's rachel maschiato or Masikiato, it's something like that, but it's 12 inches. That's all I'm gonna tell y'all. I think that's how you pronounce it. It is a suede bag, and I've had this bag for some time. Nicely, the company sent it to me, so I figured I'm gonna just see how durable this bag really is because. A girl likes to carry a lot of stuff around in a bag. Not only, like I said, I prefer a bigger bag. So, if y'all know, I do have kids. I have five kids and two grandkids, okay? So, when I say five kids, no, they're not little hollering babies running around. But my grandsons, my two grandsons are one and a half and three and a half. So, yes, I do have stuff that I carry around for my one and a half year old grandson. I'm not about to carry no diaper bag. That's, that's just not what we do. So anyway, so I do use this bag for multi-purpose, for diaper bags, and for carrying all sorts of things. Okay. It has zippers on the side so you can open it up. And as you can see, your girl has already opened the sides up. It's a 12-inch bag. They do come bigger. I think the next size, the biggest size is a 14. And there's a variety of colors. I like it a lot for one because it's super sturdy. The handles are really, really sturdy. It does come with a shoulder strap so you can wear it on your shoulders. But I really prefer not to because if I have a bag that has handles like this that are not removable, I just don't see this, the point of that. Like, if these cannot be removed then I don't really want a shoulder strap because that's just a lot of handles on one bag and I think it's kind of tacky. So, let's talk about what's inside of this bag. For one, like I said, it's very sturdy. Okay. I like the bottom because there is the flat surface but it also does have like the studs on the bottom so that way your bag is not actually sitting directly on the floor. It's not touching any type of floor or surface so it does protect your bag. So inside my bag, since y'all want to be so nosy, is one of my new favorites. That's right, okay. Some blue raspberry flavored vodka by UV Blue. This, okay, is in my bag because I just put it in my bag because I was coming upstairs to my room. So it does fit nicely in my bag. But when I do go and chill with my friend Nicole, I do bring my bag and I do carry this or my other favorite. So this is also in there and it is nice and cold because I was about to pour me a glass. It tastes delicious, delicious, honey. Yes, favorite pair of sunglasses. I do have a couple of pair of favorite, but these are like one of my favorites. I love these because these are like so like what and not to mention like when you put them on it looks dark to you guys but the lenses are not really dark so it's a very slight shade and it kind of like brightens everything up for me so it makes seeing with these on a lot more clearer and brighter than without them a bottle of a leaf for the arthritis cap no i do not have arthritis but 
my teeth have been hurting a lot lately so it's like really painful for me right now so yes i keep i keep those in because you'll never know when that pain about to strike out and when it do girl you do not want to be around me. my brand new wallet um which is like two weeks old my daughter just bought this for me from coach and i absolutely love it i love this so tati just bought this for me it's double-sided and I needed a bigger one this was the one that I did have in my bag which was a fossil one and I like tore this thing up like I had it for like a year and a half and I loved it oh my god this was my favorite and then it's this um little fake furry puff ball thing that's so trendy my car keys another puffy ball thing these are like so cool right um, since y'all want to be so nosy, mm -hmm, I do have a pot in my bag. Because you never know when you got to pop somebody upside the head. Or, being that you live in Arizona, it gets so hot out, you could just put this in your car and boil some water. So you never know what this will come in handy for. So, yes. I can't, No, I don't really carry this. I'm just messing with y'all. Some diapers. Yes, some diapers. Because, like I said, I am a grandmother and I do keep my grandson. So, I got some Love's diapers in my bag. A thing of Pampers baby wipes. Because, well, I got diapers. Why else would I have baby wipes? But you can also, like, clean their face and stuff. So, I have that pack of gum. Because you never know when Mr. Right might come along. You want your breath to smell good. A brush. Because, um... A girl wig gotta look good at all times. Because like I said, you never know who might be um, in the vicinity. Okay, so a brush, a receipt to the buffet, some, some old napkins. Like these are reusable. Like one little wipe. You never know. You never, never know. So I like to take napkins from like any fast food restaurant. I do because... Like I said, you never know. They'll come in handy. Um, a pair of socks. And the reason why I have a pair of socks in here is because me and my grandson, we like to go to this place called Jub Jub Jubilee. Jubilee. It's an indoor playground for ages zero to four and a half, five years old. And it's just indoors. And it's nothing but little little tight toys, little tight rides that they can get on little people, like for him. And I just and there's family couches, family eating area. You just sit there. It's a big open area, and it's indoors, and you just watch them play. But they have to have one socks, and you, as the guardian or the parent, cannot come in with shoes. You can come in with shoes, but you have to put them in the cubby. You have to have one socks at all times. So. I don't never know when we're going there because it's kind of like right down the street from Tati's job. So when we drop her off, sometimes we just go there. We'll be there for like hours. And I'll just sit there on my phone and he'll just go off and play. And I love it for him because, you know, we take them to like carnivals or places that we like to do things at. But he really can't. So I feel like it's only right for me to... To, or any of us to sit there while he enjoys himself and the other little kids like his age they interact with each other they be playing it's really inexpensive to go so i always have a pair of socks in my bag um like a lot of my purses have bags of so um, some socks and then in my car i have like some socks for him and um a pacifier in case he just want to not stop crying of course some lady products some sanitary pads tampon piece of mail um my charger my portable charger like when i'm out and my phone is about to die i have that tati bought me that for like five bucks which my sd card adapter like if i want to take my sd card out my phone tinky socks the strap that came with the purse like i just leave these in here because i don't really find a use for them but this is the strap that came with the purse um like i said i really don't like to use it i don't know why i kept this this is the duster bag that came with the purse it's really nice and i guess i just kept it here because i didn't want to lose it because i always say i'm gonna put something somewhere i can never find it so when i'm not using the bag i'll just take this and put it in here but it's huge right so this is the duster bag so it's like huge and satin which is really pretty like i said my lip gloss which this was from shop miss a and it was only a dollar mirror from lace wig trend that i have forever color pop lip liquid lipstick this one is in the color Little Stitches. This is the one that I like to wear a lot. My Walking Dead lighter. Because you never know when you're going to need a lighter. Oh, shoot. Another lip liquid lipstick by ColourPop. This one is Echo, Echo Park. 
I was looking for this one too. Okay, you know what? What is this? Is this like Skittles? Oh, oh. Some Reese's Pieces. Okay. So these are in here from like a couple of weeks ago when me and my daughter went to the movies. We went to see um, Peach Dragon. And some money, $5. So that is everything that's in my bag. And like I said, um, so now you can see that it does zipper. It gets smaller. I like it because it has like the little tassels on the side. Aren't, aren't those so cute? They're like really, really cute. And to close it, it doesn't have a zipper, but it has like one of these. Kind of like magnetic, magnetic closures. So all you have to do is just snap it in. You can hear that snappy snap. But it also has like the zipper pocket inside and one over here. But I like this bag because it's really functional. It's it's like to me versatile because you could either wear it or dress it up. Or well, you really can't dress it up. Like you're not gonna put it on a formal gown and go out with this bag. But you know what I'm saying? Like if you want to just put on some jeans and a shirt, cool. Or if you gotta go to work, cool. These are the things that you can do with this bag. Or if you want to carry your diapers and your baby wipes around too. But no, you cannot get really dressed up. Like go out on a um formal gown and put that on it's not gonna go but the bag is functional and sturdy and i mean it's super easy to clean i just use like suede cleaner but i haven't used it as much i haven't had it as long to have to use the suede cleaner yet um there is a code i'll post a coupon code for you guys below for teddy blake um they are fairly on the pricey side to me um for those who are wondering but the bag, like I said, is very functional and it's very sturdy and it holds a lot of stuff. Like you've seen, I had all of that stuff in it. And the pot was just in it to show you how much stuff you could put in the bag. But all the other stuff is the stuff that I normally carry on a daily basis. Extra pot in the liquor, okay? Everything else, um, just me. And sometimes it'd be like a bottle or two of water. But yes, I like the bag because for one, it doesn't spill over, spill out. It's um very, like I said, sturdy. So it's stiff and it holds well. If you want to see a closet tour, what's in my closet, then let me know because then I'll do that for you guys because I try to keep it very organized. So on that note, stay diva and divolicious. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe, and um, thumbs this video up. And I'll see you guys in a soon to come video. And the hair that I'm rocking is actually really old. It's like a year and a half old. Um, and if I remember, I'll post the link down below to the hair. But yes, it's Peruvian straight and I absolutely love it. Really great hair. It's not from AliExpress either, but I cannot remember the girl's name, but I'll post it below. So yes, you guys, stay diva and divalicious. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe, and I love you all. Bye.